Take one. <laughs> Action. Hey everybody, I'm Patricia. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a like end of spring summer clothing haul and I'm so excited because I love doing these haul videos for you guys. I love making them try on hauls and I have not done one since January, I think was the last time I did one and I've been buying some really cute stuff for summer so I think we should just jump right into it. What should I start with first? You gotta start with the most important part. What's that? Your feet. My feet? Yes. I should do shoes first? Shoes first. Okay. So the first pair of shoes that I have, I'm very excited for because I've been looking for a pair of brown sandals for, I don't know, like a month or something. And I have not been able to find a pair that I really like, but I found, but I found these. <laughs> How am I gonna do this with you in here? <laughs> I found these at Target and I really, really like them. I actually only found them just the other day when I was there with Ronnie, but they're really cute and it's a perfect brown sandal. And I've found that like when I was looking for sandals, if I were to like try them on, how many did I try on? And it just like my foot couldn't even go in the this part because it was like so small. Whose foot is that skinny? Mine's not that skinny. But I really, really like these. They're really comfortable. Um, I will also say, if you guys are interested in anything, it'll be linked down below. Uh, I did size up for these, so I'm normally an eight, but these are an eight and a half. The next pair of shoes. Ooh, cheese and rice. So the next pair of shoes that I have, I, I'm i gonna just say straight up right now, if you are a size five through eight in a women's shoe, go and check the kids shoe section. I saw a video on Instagram a little while ago and it said if you were between a five or an eight in women's shoes, you can fit into children's shoes. And I thought, yeah, okay, no way. Um, yes, wait, you can. So I found these black little like slip on shoes in the children's section, Cat and Jack, it says Cat and Jack, that's a kid's brand in Target. And I love them. They're really, really comfortable. Obviously, I've already worn them like a ton, but they're really, really cute and they have a whole bunch of different stuff over there. So if you guys, I, I'm serious, if you can fit between a five or an eight in women's shoes, you can fit into a kid's shoe. These are a five. Um, I probably could have gone to a six and size up to a six, but the five is still really, really comfortable. I just wear them with like the no-show socks and I've worn them to work a whole bunch. I love them. They're like this faux leather like black slip-on and they're really really cute. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to start with is tops. I have one pair of pants to show you guys. Yes, a pair of pants. I'm actually wearing them right now. I have been on the hunt for a new pair of ripped skinny jeans and I found these ones from American Eagle. If you guys saw my last summer clothing haul, I did like back last August, I bought a pair of skinny jeans like they were jeggings from American Eagle. I wear them all the time. I love them, they're amazing, they're great. And so I've been on the hunt for a pair of ripped skinny jeans from American Eagle and I found these ones and they're amazing. I love them so much. I'm going to just briefly say, because they are marked as high rise, they're not high rise. I went to American Eagle a little while ago with Bronny, I think, and the woman explained that like their sizing terminology changed. So things that were mid-rise are now high-rise. Things that were high-rise are now super high-rise, I think. And then things that were like super high-waisted are like extra high-waisted, whatever like their highest waist is or something like that. So these are marked as high-waisted, but they come, I'll show you guys when I try these on. These definitely hit below my belly button. I just don't really like high-waisted things. I don't like how they feel on my stomach, it just feels weird to me. But these are really comfortable, really cute, and a really subtle rip in the jeans, which is honestly really nice because um, I've had a pair of ripped jeans that I liked, they were okay, but I would have rather had what I have now. And it's a really nice dark wash, and that's what I wanted. I wanted a pair of dark wash ripped jeans, and I'm wearing them today because it's a little bit cooler today, but they are perfect for the late spring and even into the summer. So the next 
thing that I'm showing you guys is all tops. So we went through shoes, we went through pants, and the last thing I have is just all shirts. If you've watched any of my clothing hauls before, you will definitely know that I tend to just stick to buying tops and then interchanging them with all the bottoms that I have. So the first top is, oh, I even have a bathing suit. I forgot I had a bathing suit. I'll probably show you guys a bathing suit too. Everything is from, one thing is from Target and the rest are all from American Eagle. So to start first, I have this tank top from Target. I've already worn it a whole bunch. I love it. They have a whole bunch of different colors, but I tend to stick with more neutral tones and I really like wearing gray. So it's just this gray tank top. It's kind of cropped, I guess you could say. Um, but I have a pair, a couple of pair of mid-rise, a little bit high-waisted shorts that I can wear with these. Really comfortable, really cute, it's simple, it's perfect, and I tend to find in the summertime I don't want to wear anything except tank tops. Any sort of like thick t-shirt, it's, it's too much, it's too clammy, it's too hot. It gets really hot here in New York in the summertime, believe it or not. And if I'm wearing anything else besides like a spaghetti strap tank top, I'm just, I'm too warm. But I really, really like this one from Target. They have a whole bunch of different colors and I bought this one a little while ago when they had a sale. They had like 20% off if you use their app. So I think it was $6. I got it for like four bucks or something like that. So a whole bunch of different colors, but I really, really like this one. Gray is one of my colors. I love wearing gray. <laughs> and I really, really like this tank top. So the rest of the clothes I'm going to be showing you guys all come from American Eagle. Like I said before, I really try and shop their clearance stuff so I can get the best deals possible. So I will try my best to link everything down below for you guys that I got. Okay, so the first thing that I got is this blue, I don't know, it's not a tank top. It's like this blue, like ruffly lace shirt. It is a little bit cropped, but it comes like longer in the front. So I can get away with wearing it with like mid-rise stuff. I really like the sleeves. I think they're really, really cute. They have like these little ruffles on them. And I think the lace and like button detailing all the way down the front is really, really nice. And I believe all these buttons come undone. All the buttons are actual like usable buttons if that matters to you. <laughs> but it's really cute. Blue is one of my absolute favorite colors. Blue is one of the colors that looks the best on me. And it was a really cute little top. It was on sale and it was so nice. And it's just it's perfect for a summer. And it reminds me of like the 4th of July and like holidays. And it's just, it's really cute. And I can't wait to wear it. Can't you not wait to wear it too? I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next shirt that I have is this tank top. I tend to not go for like crop things, but I don't know. Lately I'm buying a lot more cropped items. Like all the clothes I've shown you so far, all the shirts are all cropped. So maybe I am finally, stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe I am finally hopping on the like cropped high-waisted trend, but I got this little tie-dye tank top. It's like a pinkish purple color. Um, also buttons all the way down the front. Really, really cute. All the buttons come undone. I probably shouldn't have done that because now I have to like take 30 seconds and <laughs> rebutton it. <laughs> but I really like it. It's typically not something that I would go out of my way and buy. It has a little bit of like a vertical striping sort of to it a little bit on the pattern and it's nice they had a blue i think too i'm pretty sure they had a blue one too but they didn't have anything in a medium and that's what i wanted but it's really cute i really like it it's really soft and really comfortable a lot of the times why i buy american eagle stuff is because yeah it might be a little bit more expensive but you're definitely getting good bang for your buck you know it's good quality stuff so this was the next shirt that I got. The next shirt that I got is also a crop top. I really think I'm like being converted into the crop top, high-waisted gang of things. But the next top is just this like, I guess like neutrally skin toned crop top. It has like these thicker straps to it and it has a really cute like lace detailing at the end. And if you look at it like pretty close, you can kind of see the different colors that are in the tank top. It's really cute. Like I said before, I tend to wear more tank tops in the summer because anything that's like a t-shirt or a super thick, it's just, it's too hot for me. So I'm really excited to wear this one. And it's a square neckline, which I typically don't go for. 
but I think square necklines look pretty good. So this was the next top that I got. Okay, the second last piece is very, very sad. I know we're already at the second last piece. Can you believe that? I know, it's so sad. So the second last piece that I have for you guys is this bodysuit. If you've seen any of my last videos, you know that I really, really, really like bodysuits. This one, I saw it online and I was like, whoa for like $11, it's a really, really cute bodysuit. It is this white sort of t-shirt bodysuit. There's the end, so it's definitely a bodysuit. But it has this really pretty scoop neck in the back, so it comes like a little bit lower. And I just thought it was really cute, and it's like a t-shirt, and I don't really have one that's like a white one or anything like that. And it's really, really nice, and it's really soft and really stretchy, and it, just like with a ripped pair of jeans, it can look so good, even though it's so simple and so basic. And I think it's a really good like transitional piece out of seasons and you can even wear it into the fall. But I think it looks really good. And I feel like you're judging me the way you're looking at me through the viewfinder and <laughs> I feel a little bit offended. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? Why is your sock on your hand? Air to breathe. Air to breathe? <laughs> So the very last piece that I have for you guys is a bathing suit. Oh my gosh. It was in my cart and then I took it out of my cart and then I put it back in my cart and then I decided, you know what, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get it. I have bought two new bathing suits this year, this being one of them and the other one, they're both one pieces. Not something that I ever thought I would find myself purchasing again. I've been a person to wear bikinis for most of my life. Don't make that face. <laughs> <laughs> but I have never felt like more confident or more like comfortable I think than I have in this one piece which is really interesting for me to think about I really really like it so it's a little bit like scooped necked but it's just one solid black one piece and then the back has this really pretty like crisscross hatching to it and then it has like a little bow at the end it's really cute it's really comfortable and i think everybody is right when they say black is slimming because i feel like it just shows my curves off the right way by still being a little bit more modest but it still looks like really good i feel like i've never looked better in a bathing suit than i have in this one so i'm really excited to wear this for all my trips coming up if you oh hey this is spinach artichoke choked it i need to go check on that <laughs> What was I saying before my timer went off? Bikini. Yes, the bathing suit. So I am really excited. If you guys didn't see my last video, you should go check it out. I mentioned that coming up next month, we're going on a whole bunch of trips. So we're gonna to go to Toronto and we're gonna to go to Puerto Rico. And then in September, we're gonna to go to LA and I'm really, really excited. And I'm definitely gonna be bringing these bathing suits with me. Maybe not to Toronto, but definitely <laughs> to Puerto Rico and maybe LA too. Who knows? I'm really, really excited to wear them and I'm really excited for the summer and just what it's gonna bring. I just love this season, it's my favorite season and it just I just feel the bestest in the summer, right? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> it's already time to close it off. Do you wanna say anything? I think that is gonna... <laughs> are, you, are you well? What's going on? Why'd you say that entire sentence with your eyes closed? I'm tired. <laughs> If you guys like this video, please give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe. <laughs> and subscribe down below, it'd mean the world to me. Smash that like button. Yes, please stick around, because like I said, I have a lot of exciting things coming up and you guys aren't gonna wanna miss it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs> Bye guys.